So you can copy things from other players' journals. That's awesome. King of Zoe slot one. That's also pretty good. Um, added a mute player in game button. I don't know about that. King or Knight's sacrifice ability has been renamed to defend. All right, I can see that. Why not like protect? Defend is the same thing. It's whatever. Nothing to worry about. They added emojis into the store. They added death note colors. It's awesome. Players who are blocked from voting will now be shown it as abstaining instead of cannot vote. So now if you're chilled, you won't know if they're chilled because normally if you're chilled, it'll say uh, this player cannot vote and then obviously they won't be able to talk. Um, so you know that they're chilled. Now it's changed to abstain so he, you might think that they're reaped instead. Um, added a casual game mode. I don't really care about casual. Probably won't be playing it. Maybe. Maybe with viewers if I have new players or something that want to join. Uh, we'll see. Butler Nightshade Wine will no longer notify the king and will kill the same day. So, literally the butler has to tell the king he nightshaded him. Otherwise the king will probably just die. Unless he has a pocket alchemist healing him all, the, all game. Or when somebody was forced by a noble. That should also show up as a sustain, yeah. Happy Hour now has a more generic message. I wish it told you what it meant. Probably you, or the drunk happy hour you last night or something. I don't know. Order execution will now only announce the kill when it succeeds. So we tested this out in the patch. Um, if you use it on the reaper, it doesn't really kill the reaper. It will still announce that it showed up in, like it'll, it'll show up in court saying that you killed this player and it didn't die. So either they were healed I don't know why it says it only announced when it succeeds. Because in the previous patch, if you tried to order execute somebody in jail, or if you tried to use it on somebody who um, is a butler and he throws a party and you try and kill that butler, it won't show up in court. So I don't know what that means. Um, I don't normally it always auto kills. New to the channel, found your videos on YouTube. What sh should I want to do if I want to play and watch the stream at the same time? Just make sure to leave lobby if I see Smooth's name. Um, Drag, if you are in the same game with me, just mute and minimize the stream. And then uh, if you die, you can come back to the stream. But um, preferably, uh, I hope that you don't have my stream open if you're in the same game with me. That's pretty much it. If you want to play, I do viewer games. Just make sure to mute and minimize so you don't see my screen. Um, King now has a 35% chance of spawning. Alright, evil king. So it went from a 20% to a 35% chance. Which is a, a big jump. Uh, the good king now has a 65% chance. So it went from 60 to 65. 5% difference. Um, not bad. Neutral king can no longer spawn at the start. So it's always evil or good. There's no neutrals. I like that. No more neutral king siding with people. Uh, mastermind. If someone tries to redirect them, they will know who they've been redirected to. So normally if a drunk or you target somebody who was tornadoed by a court wizard, it'll say someone attempted to redirect you last night. Um, obviously to them it'll say success, but to you it never did. Oh, yeah. Hey, Dragsdale, thank you so much for the Twitch Prime, man. Welcome to the Smooth Crew and to the family, friend. Thank you so much for the support. Lovely. Appreciate it. Hope you're not playing any viewer games that's bugged. Hey, thank you so much. So, now it will... Obviously, it'll say that they're, uh, they occupied you as a success, but uh, to you, you're obviously not... Um, redirected but now it'll tell you so you can actually claim uh that you've been swapped without it saying just redirected because that's how masterminds are found out a lot um that's a good change 
Mercenaries can no longer accuse their target of treason. Um, so the devs were having an issue where uh, some mercs were trying to execute their first contract if they, because sometimes their contract would claim like evil or neutral killer. Um, they would also, there was also a strategy where instead of actually telling your contract you're the merc, uh, you would guard them the first night and then you would like vote and then accidentally I voted him up and then uh, like desinged the, the vote. Excuse me. Um, to tell them that you're the merc and then they'd whisper and be like, hey, you my merc? And you'd be like, uh, I got, yeah, thanks. So you can no longer do that. So you basically just have to tell your contract that you're the mercenary now. Uh, I don't think there's another way. Um, and they will automatically vote to pardon their, their target. Uh, just so you can't betray your contract. Because a, it is technically game throwing if you try and execute your contract at any point. Um, otherwise, you know, there wouldn't be a mercenary class. That's pretty much what the devs were saying. Um, possessor. Unlimited uses of facelift. I don't know how well that works, only because you can only jump twice. Possess reduced to two uses and you will now get your target's death note. So you can have unlimited facelifts, but you can only jump twice. So if you want to change what you want to look like, I'm assuming they made it unlimited uses, so it's like a sheriff scout where you can swap that day uh, to different classes. Um, whereas if you defile yourself as mastermind, it kind of like grays out and you can't rechange what you want to defile as. Uh, I'm not really sure. We're gonna have to test this ability out. Could be useful. I still really enjoy the, um, princess logs, but with will o wisping the king and then, um, jumping as princess. But, uh, they changed the princess, so we'll get to that after. Um, that strategy doesn't work. Maybe maybe jump as hunter or something, cause some confusion. Not really sure. We'll uh, we'll see how it works. Reaper, icy touch. Chilled players can no longer talk to the dead and are instead silenced. Um, that's pretty good. Sometimes when you chill the king, uh, as Reaper, everybody in dead chat will be like, "Hey, this guy's the Reaper." If we don't actually know who he is, or like this guy's mastermind or something like that. So as soon as he actually dies that night, or Normally, if you chill the king and he has a guard, he's just going to guard himself because you can no longer kill the king if he guards. Um, that's the downside of using um, Icy Touch over Empower. Uh, not that big of a change. Scorn. Ability will be disabled after winning. You can now leave after winning and get the full gold at the end of the game. Alright. So no more troll boxes after you get your first contract killed. You can still kind of troll. But you can't use the troll box to do it. Classic mode, um, doesn't really matter to me that much. I'm probably not going to be playing classic mode. Uh, pretty much just the Inquisitor will die after he gets his target killed and Ruthless Efficiency now kills all targets instead of just magic users. Um, Major class ability changes. All games. Okay, so Psychic. Reanimation is removed. Uh, no longer... There are no DKs anymore. Uh, they added ability Inoculate. I, I think I pronounced that right. Um, you can now make a player immune to Nightshade and Bleeding permanently throughout the whole game. Probably best used on the Prince. Not really sure. I'm going to have to test it out and see how it works uh, throughout the game. Because I... Definitely won't die to a bleed as a prince. Unless you're in a cult game and you're getting swapped, you're probably going to die anyways unless you get barriered. I'm not really sure. Uh, it doesn't cure the nightshade that you person has on them. so And you, you only get one use throughout the whole game, so you gotta use it on somebody proper. You cannot use it on the king as well. I don't think you could ever use knight abilities on scoring after you won anyways. Maybe the troll box is bugged, not sure. We're gonna have to test it out. Added a knight ability called self-care. If you are attacked tonight, you will heal yourself and you get two uses. So technically, 
you can now heal yourself as a physician, which is awesome. If you think you're going to die that night, heal yourself. Um, I tested this out in the beta. Uh, I managed to heal myself from an attack and win the game. Uh, really clutch heal. Super useful. Uh, I really like this ability. Okay, so Princess. Uh, change Will-O-Wisp tells you if the target attacks anyone tonight. It's basically like you're an observer, but you don't know who they attack. You just know that they attack somebody. Only detects attacks that count as visiting. So if the sorcerer uses it, and or if the sorcerer attacks somebody and uses his ability to hide himself, you will not know, which is pretty lame. I think the sorcerer is the only one that, you know, won't count as visiting. I don't know if if the possessor possesses somebody else to attack. Um, it wouldn't show the possessor attacking clearly because he's not using it himself. Uh, yes. Psychic renamed to Mystic. I don't know why they did that. Um. It's strange. Uh, no longer has Call of the Dead. So the Psychic can no longer talk to the Dead. Uh, the Dead are actually cut from the game. Uh, there are no DKs. Psychic can no longer talk to the Dead. Uh, there is no communication with somebody who has died whatsoever. Um, they also removed the chill factor. So if you're chilled, you can't even talk to the Dead from the Reaper. So it's, it's cut. Once you're dead, you're dead. Um... So basically, uh, if you die, they're giving you the, the option to leave the game uh, with a 40% cut of the bounty, even if you win at the end of the game. Uh, so if you're dead, you're dead. No more incentive to stay in the game once that happens. Psychics are no longer in unique, so you can have two psychics. Um, it's a little weird having two psychics, uh, and if the possessor jumps, you'll have no idea who it is. New Knight Ability Conduit um, allows two players to talk to each other for the rest of the night. You will be able to hear but not speak to them. And you have two uses. Yeah. Um, link Mines and Conduit will not work on other linked players, reaped players, or other mystics. So you can now link the Prince again. They did have it changed where you couldn't link Prince anymore or people in jail. Uh, you can now link people in jail. Um, oh, they put Apostle in... Oh, no, no, Apostle's in Classic. Okay, so Apostle has now replaced Cult Numbers with Telepathy. You get two uses. So now Cult get the use of Telepathy. I don't know what havoc that's going to create, but I can tell you for sure there's going to be a lot of confusion. Because you can now technically have three now you could technically have four telepathies going off at once if you are a cult and you convert a noble and you already have an apostle or something like that or if you convert a noble and a psychic and, and the other psychics using telepathy there's gonna be so many I don't know man casual mode I'm just gonna skip this, it's whatever. Only Unseen can spawn, no Fool, Sorcerer, Inquisitor. No Royal Blood Passives. Scrub stuff. No need to worry about that. Alright, so that was the introduction of the new patch notes. Um, I'm going to be posting that on my YouTube just for everyone who watches my videos. Um, over my stream, I, get, I suppose. Why is Pink Worth 6 here? Got to keep everyone, you know, in the, in the loop. Now, I am so close to 100k, but I now need to buy colors. How much gold did you get before if you left after dead? Uh, nothing. I wanted to be the streamer to hit 100k first, and this is like... Uh, 
fives. Why is pink 6k? That's literally 26k. Do you know how much games I have to play to get 26k back? Emotes. Alright, so you basically just get like... When you're sitting at the table or you're accused, you can just hit your emote button and be like, eh, whatever. <laughs> Shoot for the stars. Oh my god. The fuck is this? You are out of here. You're done. Oh, it's the fishing hook. That's the fishing rod finger. Just wind it up real quick. It's you. Huh? Who? Me? Where? What? Huh? Not me, man. <laughs> That's something like... It's a maniacal laughter, but it looks like he's bowing. At your service, my liege. I'll get you. And I would have gotten away with it too if it weren't for you meddling kids. Pretty much what I get out of that. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I kind of want to spam this when I'm on trial. <laughs> what the fuck? Is that a booty slapping emote? That's a taunt? Come at, cometh at me, brohim? Dude, oh, that's a booty slap. I'm pretty sure it's you can only emote once per day, not game. Where's that dab emote at? Oh, that's kind of like a dab, right? You can consider that a dab. That's the closest thing his head's going to be to his fucking armpit. <laughs> Don't even know. <laughs> 